Hi, my name is Corey and I'm the invert keeper here at the museum. Not many of our visitors know that we actually breed the majority of our beetles here at the museum. And not many people know the life cycle of a beetle. So today I thought I'd show you guys the life cycle of our Derby's flower beetle. So these are our Derby's flower beetles. We have two females and one male here. The two females do not have a horn on the front of their face, while the male does have that nice horn and he'll use that to fight with other males and to impress the females. So beetles go through a complete metamorphosis, just like butterflies. They start as an egg, then they have a larva, a pupa, and an adult. So with beetles, we call the larva grubs. So this is a Derby's flower beetle grub. Uh, this guy is almost ready to pupate, so almost ready to start turning into a beetle. These guys live underground, so you can see he's pretty dirty because he's been down digging in the soil. Grubs tend to eat leaf litter, and then they also eat rotting wood. You can see his face is looking at you right now. You can see his, sick, his legs at the front there. So this guy, in just a month or two, will make a pupa cell, which are these round balls of dirt. And inside there, he'll turn from the larva into a beetle. So it takes about eight to nine months for the larva to turn into a, a full grown adult beetle. And then once they're full grown, they live for about three to four months. So this is what's actually inside of the pupa cell for a beetle. You can kind of start to see some of the features coming together. He's still wiggling around. Oh, there he goes, a big little stretch there. This guy did break out of his pupa cell, which is not normally a great thing, but I'm gonna keep a really close eye on him and uh, make sure that he makes it to adulthood. Thanks for watching and learning all about our awesome Derby's flower beetles and the breeding we do here at the museum.